In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to draw UML diagrams for both abstract classes and interfaces. If you remember from a previous video that I had, UML stands for Unified Modeling Language, and it's a way to visually display all the classes in your Java program. So the UML diagram looks the same for concrete classes, except that the font is italicized for an abstract class. So take a look at an abstract class called Shape. The font is italicized. We list the abstract methods. And that's also italicized. And both circle and square classes are pointing to shape because they're both subclasses of the class shape, and shape is the base class. In this picture, we're drawing a UML diagram for interfaces. The UML diagram shows interfaces with double angled brackets and the word interface inside, and then underneath it, the name of the interface and interfaces in the diagram point to classes that implement them by a, a dotted or dashed line. So in this example we have an interface called measurable that has two method headers get area and get perimeter and notice that there is a dashed or dotted line going from square to measurable meaning that square implements measurable and that's basically all you had to do to depict interfaces in a UML diagram. 